coming up on uh, 2 o'clock, day 5, uh, we're hungry. We're also uh, uh, running away from very bad weather that's uh, coming up the river. If we were smart, we would uh, continue on to uh, Vicksburg. But we have stopped here in uh, Lorman because uh, I simply cannot resist the old country store, Craft Small and Restaurant. I understand that they have the best fried chicken in Mississippi here. Oh, and some vegetables, which I badly need. All right, fellas, let's eat. Once upon a time, folks dreamed from all over Clearborn and Jefferson counties to sell cotton, buy shoes, and trade gossip at the country store, which has been sitting on this spot for over 100 years. Today, folks come from far and wide for Arthur Davis's cooking, especially his chicken, which disappears from the 595 all-you-can-eat buffet at breakneck speed. I have to apologize for the lousy camera work here, but the uh, air inside the old country store smells so good that I can't get anyone to do any work. Legs, thighs, breasts, cornbread and greens all shoveled into pie holes with shameless abandon. Brett's eating like a prison, somebody in jail. He's got you know, both mitts around the... He's got his hands guarded. <laughs> well, I'm gonna see if there's any... Uh, fried chicken left. There's not just the last piece. And there's, there's, there's no more fried chicken. So uh, my, I've dilly-dallied around too much. No, you have this piece. No, no, you eat your chicken. This right here is why it's bad to be me, because this is where the fried chicken was, and now there is no more fried chicken. There are greens, and that's good. I'm gonna have, have some greens here in a bit. And I suppose I could have uh, some, some pork rib, but what I really want, it's gone. Mm. I won't, I'm not gonna have that now. Brett, as you can see, he has chicken. I do. And that's, no, 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 you're a working boy. It takes a lot of energy to sleep in the motorhome all day, so you, you eat that chicken. What's this? What is this, sir? You're bringing chicken? Because, you know, I didn't get to have any chicken. I knew it. I didn't get to have any chicken, and now you came out at the last yeah, minute and brought me chicken. some chicken. Just yours, right there. Just mine. Just for All you. me. All yours, especially. <laughs> You're a good man. That's right. My days have changed now. I have chicken. None of you guys are getting any of it. None of you. Nobody getting any of my chicken. My chicken. I'm slipping away. This is all for me. I'm gonna come over here away from all these jackals who ate my chicken. Hey, Mike, well, you're not gonna come over here where I am? Hey, I told you to get out of the chicken. I'm getting some chicken. Get out of there. Come and catch me. You eat that chicken, I'm gonna make the rest of the shoot a living Hades for you. Oh, you can have one. I hope it burns you. Oh, ha, ha, ha. It's hot. He didn't know it. What are you eating, old man? Why are you eating my chicken? I told you you couldn't eat my chicken. You already had... Oh. Okay. In all honesty, this is the best fried chicken I've ever had in my life. Without question. It's crisp. It was in no way greasy. The flavor is... Tastes like chicken. That's what you meant. That's Do you close. soak the chicken in anything, like buttermilk or anything like that? No, season it. No. Season it, not the chicken for tomorrow, be seasoned today. In what? Salt and pepper and shake. A shake of what? Shake. Oh, you guys have secrets. You got a shake. <laughs> shake. Or like a little paprika maybe in that? Shake. 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 It was shaking. Mr. D's fried chicken is the best fried chicken in the world. In the world. You made a deal with somebody. In the world. I did. This isn't natural. 
I promised him that I'll always fry chicken fresh. You promised God Almighty that you would do your chicken fresh? fresh. Do you believe that God has blessed your yes, efforts here? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Only with him. Only with him is the reason. He's the reason for the season. And he's got people coming from all over the world to see me to try that fresh chicken. Do it's you, amazing. Do you think there's good fried chicken in heaven? Yeah. Yeah. You know, my grandmother's up there. Grandmama, 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 grandmama. You just break into oh, song. Oh, grandmama. Grandmama was my cornbread. Cooking queen. I would try to join you. chicken and a biscuit. I didn't get a biscuit either. I didn't get a biscuit. Two piece chicken. You didn't get none of that cornbread? I made that song up, man. You know, the guy asked me, said, I don't got no another verse. I said, well, I'm waiting on somebody to write it for me, so. Mr. D wouldn't give up the shake recipe. Mr. D wouldn't give up the shake recipe. Oh, I cried and I cried and I begged and I tried. But Mr. D wouldn't give up the shake recipe. Well, with that note, I'm going up here. <laughs> Despite my singing, you really should stick around. There's plenty of feasting to come.